So, I am so excited. Oh my goodness. What I went through. So, um, I am going through menopause. Um, and it's, it's horrible because I wake up sometimes with chest pains. Um, I get these hot flashes all day long. And, uh, one of the thing, one of the things about that is, uh, um, insomnia. So I've already had problems all my life. And then, uh, when I turn 50, I'm falling asleep pretty quickly, sleeping a lot better unless there's an issue. And that's what's been happening there's no issues there's no, nothing to worry about really and <laughs> I'm uh, waking up early in the morning so um, <clears throat> I went on Instagram and uh, one of my friends <clears throat> she um, she sent me a, a, a post that the new spring um, collection called Queen of My Heart has been released from Wet and Wild, and uh, CBS got it first. Um, and like I said, I, I said every time my husband goes away, that's when I find it. However, this came he went went away on Wednesday, and this collection came out on Monday on CBS. And then I think um, I think it was it, it was either a Tuesday, yeah Tuesday at Walgreens, but mine did not have it. I, since I kept waking up early, I was calling every CBS that was 24 hours. And they said our shipments come in on Tuesday. Okay, so then I uh, made sure that I did not fall back asleep, which as if I could if I wanted to. Um, but I was exhausted and I like forced myself to stay up and call the CBSs. And they're not as helpful as the Walgreens ladies, at least my CBSs. And, you know, I got responses like, we don't sell Wet and Wild when I know they do, or uh, they're not as nice or as helpful. And so, yeah, nothing, nothing was happening. Um, but then, and then um, I knew that Alvin got it in. That is too far of a drive for me. It's not even a nice drive. So unless they had the entire collection, I wasn't going down there. And, and I already knew it. They said, look, we got everything out except for the highlights. Somebody bought out the highlights, which I already expected. I mean, they're heart shaped. They're so cute. Well, the whole collection is adorable. And I knew that this was going to be a fast, fast, uh, you know, sell out. They only put two of each thing in the display. And I already had a feeling that it, it now, Wet and Wild did announce that it will go up in March on sale on the website. Whether I don't know what day in March, but I have one of those feelings that's because they don't put a limit that that was going to sell out fast. So um, I took advantage of my lack of sleep, <laughs> waking up early in the morning, to keep calling a uh, 24-hour places and stuff like that. And um, so um, around here at least um they're saying that they get the shipments in they got this just got a shipment in at walgreens and they didn't have it um as to whether it was sitting in the back or not i mean i i don't know why alvin did and they didn't but uh, I, I have a handful of i'm blessed because i have a handful of people that are nice and they'll check and they like no nope, that did not come in so they said, well, it, it, it sounds like, because their ship days change all the time with holidays. So they said they'll get another shipment in Friday night or Saturday morning. And that, so it should be up by the weekend and it should be in there. So um, I was a little bit frustrated and, and getting anxious because I knew that this was going to be one of those things. And I knew I wasn't going to be around Saturday. So I was afraid that it's going to pass me by because I won't be around. Um, cause I'm taking my daughter somewhere up, up in, um, like near, near Midtown in Houston. And I was going to be there for quite a few hours. So I was just, just afraid I was going to miss this. So, and also there's like one or two people at the Walgreens around me who are just not nice. And, uh, I don't know if it's, you know, I always think it's maybe it's because of my weight that I feel like they don't like me, but maybe they're like that with everybody. I don't know. But like, so a couple of people were like, well, if we got it. Uh, we're not going to put it up till we finish it with the tote. So, um, I don't know when it's going to go up. Probably not till Friday, Saturday. <sighs> but then you got the nice ones that said, you know, it probably is going to come in on Friday. It should be up by Friday afternoon. 
So anyway, that made me anxious knowing that I wasn't going to be around. So I was exhausted from lack of sleep. I felt like I could barely keep my eyes open. And also my, my allergies are getting so bad that I, I, I feel like it's going, I'm, I don't know. Some people say you could develop asthma and I, I haven't been feeling good. I feel like I'm getting that. So yesterday I was like, I mean, exhausted, exhausted. And one of the reasons was too, I had because I had to drive my husband to where the bus was going to be all the way up out in North Houston. So that, you know, it's a stressful drive, a lot of traffic, they're working on the highway. You know, because all the way out in Northwest Houston, I was like exhausted to the max yesterday. But at the last second, I thought before I went to like take a nap, before I had to drive my son to school, is why don't I call my old Walgreens, my old stomping grounds, you know, where I used to live. And sure enough, um, when I called, the lady said, we just opened up that box. We were just about to put it out. And I begged her please don't put that out i will be there in 15 20 minutes good traffic 15 it was not good traffic but i still made it there within like 20 minutes or so and I, i'm really grateful to i mean she doesn't have to do that for me there's just really nice people they just don't have to do that for you but they're just so nice they do it anyway and i was able to get the collection um but my daughter because my uh, up in new york the the shipments come in on wednesdays and it looks like they got the shipments in two on wednesday my daughter told me, and what I noticed is, just like the um, Gilded Age collection, the eyeshadows were broken in, in, in these collections, so I'm not really sure what was up with that, but, you know, thank God it was just one when I, and my daughter said two from her, her kit came, you know, her a display or shipper came broken, and this one was just one, but I mean, she had just opened it up and said, you know, you could go through it, so... I really appreciate that. The uh, other girl that was there didn't seem like she really appreciated me doing that. But I, I just thank God for this is really, this is a few nice people that, you know, if you ask them to, you know, to help you out, they help you out. And so I really feel blessed because of that. Like even my, um, when I got the sugar pill, a feline fancy, I was blessed because I just got my income tax check. <laughs> so I was able to get that. And then this time, end of the month is like the worst time, but I got cash back from, from my, I didn't even know I had that. My electric company gives you cash back. And so I had just enough money to pay for this collection. So I'm, I mean, I'm just really feeling so blessed. I mean, I worked hard three days um, when I wake up just calling the 24-hour places and three mornings in a row. And, I, you know, my persistence and my calling. And I don't know if I drove some people crazy. I don't know because sometimes I forgot who I called and I called twice. Um, but, you know, I, I just felt so blessed that, you know, that even in financial hardships, the money always appears somehow um, for me to get, you know, what I really, really desire. And, you know, you know, I believe in God and God gives us the desires of our heart. So I got the collection. First thing I want to show you, and I'm hoping this is permanent. Look, it comes in a heart shape. Everything's like heart shaped in this collection. So cute. But, but the actual product isn't, isn't heart shaped. So this is the Kabuki, nice and soft. Of course, I mean, you know, heart shapes is going to get any girl. I, I'm telling you, these are going to fly off the shelves. Um, little heart shape. I was wrong. It, from the picture that they showed originally, I thought there was going to make maybe 10 or 12. There's actually 16 colors. But again, um, I know that you're only going to get probably, t depending on how big or small your lips are, I have pretty full lips. I'm going to probably get only two uses out of this. Um, maybe. If you've got thin lips, maybe three. If you've got very, very full big lips, you're probably only going to get one use out of this. This was probably the most expensive thing. This was $6. Um, so, and it's got colors, you know, ranging from a frosty white to a, a nice deep red and a deep plum. And, oh, uh, um, I was unsure about this, but I saw some people swatch these. Um, my daughter uh, got hers off the, off the display and... Uh, she tried it on. It's really nice. These are like dual chromes. Like I thought, how is this going to come out? That purple on your face or that pink on your face. But this has like a, a whitish violet and this has like a beigey pink in there. And these are dual chrome. I just, I didn't even open these because when I got back, it was already like, uh, I ate and it was time for me to take my son to school. I had to wait with him. By the time I got back, it was time to cook dinner and I was like, forgot. I conked out. <laughs> so I haven't even opened these. 
So this is like a purpley with blue dual chrome and like a pinky uh, beige. And I do see like maybe violet dual chromes in this. Oh, um, the, they, they named this. This is called From Heart to Finish. This one's called Lilac to Reality. And this one's called The Sweetest Bling. The eyeshadows, I'm going to be honest, I was kind of disappointed. Um, they didn't look spring to me at all. They didn't scream out spring to me. They scream out more fall to me. Um, so let me start with the first color. Um, is hieroglyphic heart, and this is like the like the more of the darker nudes. Um, you've got like a little mauve in there, and like a brown color there, and like a dark beige color there. Um, and this is meant to be worn as a smoky color because it says the darkest color is the lid. The next one is heart and <laughs> heart and heavy. That's the prettiest one. Because you've got like your pink and like your burgundy-ish violet and your like cream color on top. So this one is called Will You Marina Me? This in my, when I went to, the, when I was looking through the boxes, this is the one that was broken. But if it's just one broken, you might want to ask them for a discount. Um, because if it's just one color broken, you can just put it back in, pre with pour alcohol on it, like a couple of drops of alcohol, and press it in. And it should be as new. But this one is Will You Marina Me, and this is the one with the teal and the brown and, like, the dark cream color up here. And then this is the only thing that, remember, I, it, was, it was a lip tint, and the color they showed was orange. When they showed the display, it had, like, a pink, like, a reddish orange and an orange. I'm not sure, but I decided to just pick up the pink, and these are lip tints. I don't know, maybe if, if I see, if I, when it finally reaches here, I'm pretty sure this is the last things that are going to go. I'll probably look through them and maybe decide if I'm going to get the red or not. But um, it was kind of like warm, so I decided not to get it. But this is the pink lip and cheek tint. Kiss me if you can. It's got the little hearts there. So, I, I like I said, in, I, in some places, uh, like I think... The girls from Missouri said that they landed there earlier in the week. In New York, they landed there uh, last uh, yesterday. Um, so here, I'm pretty sure by by the weekend, it's going to be up here in the Houston area. Like I said, it was it was available up in in the mid um, the medical center part of Houston, but not here in Pearland. Not sure, not or the part of Houston, uh, Clear Lake area wasn't there yet either. Not in CVS, not Walgreens. But um, um, Five Below said they got a huge shipment in and that they think that they might have it there. I mean, they've been getting all the displays. So you've got your Five Belows. I'm pretty sure my HEB will finally get it in. Uh, your Rite Aid, your Kerr, or whatever. Um, my daughter went to um, Harmons and they still didn't have it. But I'm pretty sure your Harmons, your, your friend Myers, uh, Majors will have those in. If they don't have it yet, we'll have it in soon. Yeah, so the collection came in. I'm really excited about it. So I'm not sure if I'm going to I'm gonna do this start on this for this coming few weeks. I probably will because I'm really excited about it. So that's the collection. Be, keep your eyes open. It's landed. Like I said, don't forget uh, Five Below. Any of your local uh, drug stores or cosmetic stores. I mean, you know, make your phone calls. I was persistent. Uh, one of my friends was like, the, in her neighborhood, they don't have it. And she was like, you're so lucky. I'm like, girl, I went through heck for three days <laughs> with lack of sleep. <laughs> but I, would, I, I really, I know, I know, I know this is going to fly off the shelves. Um, so, okay. Um, I will see you next week. And like I said, I'm probably going to do these for you. Um, so, yeah. See you next week, and uh, so love you all. Mwah. Bye.